and now we come to a time of prayer. First of all, we look inwards and we look at ourselves. We pray for our own lives. Lord, we pray into the calling that you've placed on our lives, the gifts and talents you've given us, the potential that we have to exercise. Help us respond to you. Help us to live the lives that you have called us to do. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord, we next pray for our community. We thank you that we are part of a caring, loving, compassionate community here at St Jude. We pray for your church wherever we may be represented. We pray for those that we know specifically who are suffering either through illness, through grief, through financial struggle or anything else, Lord, that is getting in the way of our community's relationship with you and each other. Be close to them. May they see your power and your love in action. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Next, we pray for our nation. Lord, we pray for our relationship with the nations around the world. We pray for your kingdom to come. We pray specifically, as today many will be out celebrating and taking part in Halloween. We pray that by your Holy Spirit, your hand will move and the light of the world that is your son, Jesus Christ, will reign supreme, will reign in glory over this nation once again. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And finally, we pray for our world. And in a time of climate crisis, we pray for COP26. We pray for those coming together to discuss climate change. To talk about the issues in this world that you gifted to us. May there be people there of good standing and of humility and dignity that will make decisions and follow through that will benefit this world that you created. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The Collect for today. Almighty and eternal God, you have kindled the flame of love in the hearts of the saints. Grant to us the same faith and the power of love, that as we rejoice in their triumphs, we may be sustained by their example and fellowship. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. We conclude our time of prayer by saying the words of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come and your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen.